temperature today? Today in St. Albert, expect a high of minus 4 and a low of minus 12. Oh, it's getting a little kind of warmer. <laughs> Let's see what we got here for tea. I cannot believe it is day 15. Can you? Day 15. Yutsu Citrus. Huh? Sencha Matcha Yuzu Citrus Green Tea. Well, that's a mouthful. Let's see what the little poem says. 15. There you go. Comforting flavors for cold weather days. Sancha and citrus bring bright, sunny rays. I have never heard of this. Sencham, I know what matcha is. Yutsu, citrus. What's yutsu? I don't know what yutsu is. Green tea, green tea. Natural flavor and yutsu peel. So it must be a fruit. Ooh, that's going to be interesting. I'm not sure if I have time to drink it because this morning my daughter's picking me up. And we're going out shopping. I don't have the heart to tell her that I don't feel great today. I just don't because she was really... She goes, Mom, I'm so looking forward to it. But we'll manage. You know what I mean? So I'm just going to have a coffee. That might help wake me up a little bit. I bet you the green tea would do the same exact thing because it's caffeine. But I'm not sure if I want to try Yutsu Citrus before I head out the door. <laughs> I almost forgot about Sephora. How could I do that? Oh my goodness. Okay, day 15. I think we said they were mostly on this side. There it goes. That for me today looks like nothing. What? Hang on. So it's another eyeshadow. I like this. It's a colorful matte and looks like almost like a fawn or dove. Flawless. I love this. This is the kind of eyeshadows I wear. Just plain, you know, not too much color, neutral. Let me see what it looks like on my hand. I don't know if you guys can see it. Yeah, you can. Right there. See, it's very, very neutral, but it looks nice and covers, like, impurities in your skin, sorry, like in your skin tone. It's very pretty. I like that. I will wear this out. Don't go hiding in there. Love that one. Okay, so... An interesting tea, which we will try later, and a beautiful eyeshadow. And I just have to stir my coffee. I was making my coffee, I was like, hey, I'm missing something. Sephora! So let me stir my coffee. I'm waiting to hear from my daughter. I'm going to try to start my sock before she gets here. We'll see. I switch. I am going to bring my little mini backpack because if it gets, I can't carry a lot. But when you put stuff on your back, it's not that hard. This is one of those Herschel um, backpacks, but I don't recommend this swishy one because I traveled with it once. And it got holes in the bottom, so I had to put, can you see there's packing tape down in there? Because there were little holes breaking through. So, yeah. Anyways, but the thicker Herschel ones are fantastic. Why don't I do is just put the basic things I need in here. I always wear Thieves Oil when I go to the mall. Do you guys know what Thieves Oil is? Uh, 
way back, way, way back in ancient times during the bubonic plague, the thieves would go into the homes of the people that had died from the plague and steal their jewelry and gold and whatever else. And the king could not figure out why they weren't getting bubonic plague. So he called them and he said, I'll forgive you your transgressions if you tell me what it is that you do so you're not getting sick. And they said they had a combination of essential oils because of the stench of the body, so they would cover their bodies in these oils. And as it turns out, the blend of oils they use are antiviral. So I clean my house with thieves oil. I wear it when I go in crowds. So it's in my bag. I cannot forget our little holiday planners. Love it. And I have to throw in a pen. I have to make a list. So there's that. All I need for money is my debit card and I have my, I always have my driver's license and ID with me. So I'll stick that in there. No need to bring a whole wallet. This baggie is three little medications just in case I need them. So I'll stick them in this pocket up here. So I'm gonna put my holiday planner in here. I'll be giving one to Deanne. And then all I need is a pen, which I'll attach to that. And my lipstick I'll put inside my little hand lotion. And that's it. So this is pretty much empty. So then when it gets, you know, I buy things, they can go in there. Be easier. Deanne usually carries everything for me, but I feel bad. So at least this way I'll be able to carry some things on my back. And it's not going to hurt. Do you know what I mean? Oh, Deanne just said, just leaving preschool to go home because she's a little preschool teacher of three-year-olds. She says they are the most adorable, sweetest little blessings you can even imagine. And she's also a personal trainer, so she works a lot. What's this, isn't it? And I'll just zip that up. Oh, I know what I was going to say. And my phone will either go in here or in my pocket. Just depends, because if I'm vlogging, I like to have my camera with me all the time. So, yeah. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. So I think this is the black that I used in the sock. But I can't seem to see any of those little flicks of... Oh, yes. So you can see them. There's red and yellow there. There's one there, blue there. Yeah, yeah, that is it. I was pretty sure, but you know, don't want to do this fiasco again. That was funny. Okay, Dee. Hi. I have a present for you. Okay. Do you remember back in the day? Mm -hmm. In our stitch stitchy group? Yes. Or not our stitch oh, group. Oh, stitch and bitch? No, no, the yard, the card making. What were we called? Did we have a name? I don't think we had a name. And did we have anyone else with us? Yeah, remember I used to set up the tables and everyone would come and make cards? Once? Oh, with like Jen and yeah, Amy and stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So anyway, I thought I would make you... Mm-hmm. What's this, Dee? Oh, a holiday platter! What, what did we used to call it? <laughs> a holiday platter. A, what do we a holiday platter no it was the this y holiday yeah it was a holiday platter. oh because the a came off yeah, the, no the y the off. y came off oh look at my little holiday platter so that's for gift this check it twice receipts groceries and there's paper in the grocery and events and pull, huh? out, pull out the event one December. So you can write all your little... Thanks, Mom. Oh, that's not yours. This is the oh, nice one. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> this one's nicer. So that one's mine. This is nice. A holiday platter. Yeah. Holiday Fun. Platters. You Cute. both have twinsy ones. I have all my lists on my phone right now. Yeah, so you can just write them down. And look on the last page. That's why that one's nicer. Oh. The, yeah. Events. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome, Dee. So we can use it today. And you've got little gold. I see that. I love yeah. it. Oh, here's yeah. some mu animal mugs. Maybe there's one over here. 
Oh, wouldn't it be nice if they had one like this? That was a hen. Oh, that'd be cute. That's not a mug, is it? What is this? It's for your kitty. Oh, yeah. It's a kitty. Oh, do you want this for Christmas? Oh, do you want this? No, okay. yes. No, look. I see. It's kittens. You know how you love them? Oh, I really like this for Christmas baking. Oh, it's on sale. I'm getting this. I know, but I'm going to get this for Christmas baking. What is it? It's a spatula. Oh, that's cute. It's black. And it's got, it's only $6.99. Perfect. This is why you check out this area. Dan hates cats. I'm not a fan of cats. I'm allergic, so whenever I can buy her something that's a kitten related, I do, but I want to find it on sale. I know there's lots of cat lovers out there, but unfortunately, we are those people. And this is pretty. Or in the store signs and it's fabulous. It's just it has everything you could possibly think of. From designer clothing clothing that costs, you know, in the thousands to something that costs six ninety nine. So literally everything. Ooh, look at this. What is this? They're like not for me, but what are they? Looks like I need some lipstick. I managed to put a little dent on some things just in one store. I love this store. It's beautiful. I hear a live trumpet player. She's gonna jump. She's gonna do a big jump. Her. Watch. Oh, she duped us out. I thought she was preparing for like a, a big, big jump. Pouring water for my tea. It smells really. There's something in here I don't like the smell of, so I actually think I might have found a tea I don't like, but it's probably that yutsu root, whatever that is. But I'm not gonna say I don't like it just yet. Let's just give this a good old college try. I'm making myself an egg. All I ate was half a banana. There's the other half. So I'm making myself an egg, even though it is four o'clock. Almost supper time. I'm hungry. Peppers. So let's reboil this. I know it just. Can you guys see that stuff in the bottom is just starting up again? The line build up, so I'll have to clean it again. It doesn't come out because there's a screen there, so it's filtered out. But still, that's how hard our water is. So I cleaned that, what, two weeks ago? The beginning of this vlog. And it's back again. I think it's back. Can't really tell. 
Anyways, let's give this a little thing. I don't know if I'm going to like it, but I don't want to say I'm not. Do you know what I mean? Let me smell it. I could use a nice cup of tea. But it doesn't smell as odd as the tea bag smells. So let's just let this steep for a little bit. I'm just sitting on the sofa vegging since I got home from shopping. I could probably fall asleep. My clothes are falling off of me. But I'm drinking that tea and it's actually really good. I put a slice of lemon in it with some honey. Namarunos. So I'm going to finish up my sock here. And then I might just go, you know, a mean lean like this and crash and fall asleep. But it's too late to fall asleep. So if I take a nap now, then I'll be up all night and I won't be able to sleep. And then I'll have to sleep in tomorrow. So, yeah, perhaps not. But I really want to take a nap. But it's too late. You want to snap out of it. Go wash your face in cold water. So I thought I'd show you guys a haul of what some of the stuff I got today. But first I'll show you what I did on my socks. So this was like the Harlequin dancing. It's still the party scene. This is a party scene around the Christmas tree. And then these were the kind of Harlequin, like clown figures that were dancing. And yeah, only thing different, two different greens. That's okay. Don't let it bother you, Monica. Don't, you're not tearing it apart. <laughs> so, the first store we were in, I think I showed you, I said it was one of my favorite stores, and it is. And if you live in Canada, and you know the Hudson's Bay Company is like a big department store, much like Macy's, and there's also Holt Renfrew, which, Holt Renfrew, <laughs> can't even say it, which is a high-end designer store. I used to work there many years ago. I was the manager of the Miss Renfrew department, but it's very high-end designer clothes. And it's like Simon's is like Holt Renfrew and the Bay had a child and named him Simon's. So like I mentioned in the video, you can buy anything from the most expensive dress for three thousand dollars right down to an item for fifteen dollars that's why i love it not because i get the expensive stuff but anyway it's very french it's from montreal so i'm sure it's called simon but we call it simon's so first i bought one of these really cool looking isn't that the coolest spatula it's kind of got that uh Buffalo checkish thing. So I got that for Laura to go with her chocolates. And then I got Ozzy. He wanted a new cross chain. So I got him that. And then I got Turner. I got him some really fabulous shoes. And then all the guys are wearing pearls now. This was in the men's department. So I got him some pearls so he can look really Rico suave. I'm going to put all that back in this bag. Right, we're moving on to the store called Morph. Um, Deanne's sister-in-law, Tasha, was telling both of us about the store Morph. And she said it's really weird because it's right next door to Max Makeup. And she said everything is so cheap and I don't get it because it's right next door to Max. So, um, in, oh, I took everything out. So, and guess what? I really use this. I've got all my lists of what I bought, everybody. All of my receipts are in here. This came in super handy. Love my holiday planner. Okay, so this Morph, it's beautiful. It's Morph Highlight Stick. I got one for me, so I'll show you over there. This is for Felicia, Curtis's girlfriend. This is for Shannon. This is wet highlighter. It's like a facial balm. It is so pretty, but it's definitely for Caucasian skin, the color. So they had other colors, but they were sold out. So I got one for Julia and one for Shannon. 
And then I got this for the end. This is eyeliner, and that's the color of the eyeliner. Liner, not eyeshadow. So fabulous. I got her two of these morphs. And then I got her, this is a duo um, bronzer and blush combination. And I wish I could show you guys. Hang on. Yeah, I can't. It'll rip the box. But the blush is, when you are a darker complected black woman, orangey tones look better on you than pinky tones. So it's a beautiful orangey kind of a blush with the bronzer that almost matches it. And then these two are bronzers too. So that's for Deanne. And then I got Deanne new makeup brushes. I put that back in the Morph bag with all this stuff. So I don't want to lose the little things. I hate to say I bought most of the stuff was for me, but I'll explain why in a minute. But here's that Morph bronzer. And this is the lid for it. And so let's just put apply. It's so pretty and it's like a lotion. So it's really smooth going on. So obviously you're not gonna wear that much as a highlighter, but it's beautiful and a beautiful color. So, and these, we said to her, how much are these? Well, those, those are $1.35. We're like, excuse me? That's why Deanne got two and I got two and Felicia got one because a dollar thirty-five. Crazy. I feel like going back and buying some more for somebody else. Do you know what I mean? So then I got, you guys have probably seen, yeah, in my kitchen, hanging that yellow one. You probably think I never change my tea towels and what a slob, but I do because I use these. They are fabulous. They are the best tea towels I've ever had. And I got them from Simon's and that's where the other ones came from. $9.50 for three of these. They are fantastic. And if I could have all of my tea towels like this, I would. I love them. So I've got three more. I got myself a little gingerbread man spatula. I might give this as a present, I'm not sure. Then I got myself some reindeer coasters and I might give these as a gift. I never use coasters, so I don't know why I thought I needed them, but they were on sale for, I think they were three something. Yeah, they were on sale, so I hope she put marked it. I got these, they're from Vans, you know, the shoes. But I have, uh, I can't remember what it is that I needed to put a patch in. I think it's that, that backpack. And so these were on for $4.99. So I got them because I knew I needed those. I got some napkins to go with my bright red napkins I got at Ikea for Christmas Day. I just bought these for me, those razor, you know, those razory things. They're good for facial hair, chin hair, nose hair, whatever. Um, they're really, and eyebrows are fantastic. And there's 12 in here. So yeah, I got those. And then I got myself the same brushes as I got Deanne. So let's have a look at these. So these are all the new makeup brushes. So I got one for Deanne too. I'm just looking through and seeing, you know, it's a angled brush. These two are eyeshadow brushes. This is a blush highlighter brush powder. Same thing. These are eyeshadow eyebrows. I'm not sure what that one's for. Does it say? Blender brush. So the blend it all in. This one is a foundation brush. Put your foundation on with this. And this looks like another eyeshadow. Oh, they call this one a blending brush as well. So yeah, pretty cool, hey? They're nice. But I do need some, I need some, um, 
new Nintendo. So, one for me, one for her. Uh, Indy, this cute little Christmas book called The Biggest Little Boy. And I don't know if you can hear that. These are all kind of like glittery embossed little stars and ornaments on the tree. And I just thought, oh, I didn't know that Poppy Harlow from CNN wrote this. I did not know that. Well, that's cool, because I like her on CNN. So, it says, Luca loves big things. Oh, and his best friend's name is Luca. <coughs> Excuse me. Big trucks, big buildings, big bowls of pasta. But what he wants most is the biggest Christmas tree of all. With Christmas approaching, Luca goes in search of a special tree, but he soon finds out that what matters is having a big heart. Nice. It's beautifully illustrated. Really nice big pictures. And I really like this little book. And it's supposed to be $23.99. And we got it for $4.99. So that's a bang deal. Then I got, are these mine or Deanne's? I think these are Deanne's. Uh, yeah, look at these pajama pants. I got myself a pair. How can you resist black Santas? And look at the tie. It's got a pom-pom. How cute. So Deanna's pair and I have a pair. Look how cute. Love them. And I think that's it, guys. Let's see. Yeah, that's it. So that's what I bought today. And I'm tired. So we thought we would order pizza tonight. We're being very daring because you know me. So we've got very simple, mostly cheese, a little bit of pepperoni, nothing too crazy. So, so doesn't this Pizza Hut pizza just look delicious? So we're going to eat our pizza. And I'm going to sign off for today. And I'll see you guys all tomorrow. And thanks for watching. Bye.